top six Korean skincare products for mature skin. I'm Laura Ray. I've tested out so many products this year. These are six of my top products. Let's start with a favorite of mine. I first tried this in a little kit that CauseRx had and loved it so much that I ordered it. I just can't get enough of this. It's their Snail Mucin. It's an essence. It's actually called the Advanced Snail 96. Now, this is amazing if you have dry, dehydrated skin, or if you just want like a lightweight moisturizer. For many of you with oily skin or normal skin, you may not even need a moisturizer if you use this. Now you apply it right after cleansing. It sinks quickly in the skin and I love how well it plays with makeup. It's also supposed to improve your elasticity over time and that's something that I'm working on. I'm almost 60 and I find that my skin doesn't bounce back quite as fast as it used to. So I'm hoping that over time this will help with that. But I'll tell you one thing, it's great for sensitive skin. I am so reactive to products. There's no fragrance in it. I love that. I can just put that on and not have to worry about any breakouts or anything from the ingredients. This is the Beauty of Joseon, their Revive Eye Serum. Now, what's interesting about this is you can use it in other places than your eyes. I bought this as a replacement for my more expensive Aven, the Physio Lift, the Eye Under Eye Cream. This can actually be used all over the face. It has 2% retinol, and then it also has ginseng root, which is very moisturizing. I love this. Again, I have very reactive active sensitive skin. I could put this all over my skin and get no reaction and I feel like it just smooths those fine lines and wrinkles. If you're looking for an all-over product, one that is sort of one and done, I love the Kahai Stick. This is the Wrinkle Bounce. This is so famous in South Korea. A lot of the soap opera stars and movie stars use it, but this can be used all over the face. It can be used around the eyes, uh, forehead wrinkles, around the mouth here, and these folds here. Also for the neck, now it has a slight scent to it, but it doesn't seem to bother me. Now this is a combination lip balm, eye cream, neck cream, all in one. And you can carry it in your purse and it's not messy. And it can be reapplied also throughout the day. Now it has something called a salmon complex. And the nice thing is it plays well with makeup. You can just, if you have any dryness during the day, you can just sort of go like this and just tap it in or use your finger like this. Again, it's perfect for dryness during the day anywhere on the body. This has something in it called Jeju's Fermented Oil, uh, Jeju's in South Korea. And I feel like this adds a lot of moisture to my under eyes. And I just love that I can use it all over. This number is a number three serum. It's called a Skin Softening Serum. I've talked about it before. It is a little miracle worker in this glass bottle. It has bifida. It has galactomyces and niacinamide. It's made for smoke smoothing rough skin. As we age, again, our skin loses that elasticity. So those pores appear larger because the skin isn't bouncing back like it used to. This has really helped me in the under eye area. This area here for me has always had enlarged pores. And as I've gotten older, I feel like those pores are getting larger and also that my makeup collects in that area. So I found that skincare is really important for that area. And the Numbuzzin 3, this skin softening serum has really helped to smooth that area out. I don't notice the pores so much. I have a much smoother look there, which when I put my makeup on, my skin looks so much better. So this, along with this, is my little powerhouse. Let's talk about this. This is the Numbuzzin Super Glowing Essence. Now this essence has 50 fermented ingredients in it. I've used this for quite a while. I love it. It does give my skin a beautiful glow. Now this you would apply right after you wash your face. 
I love it for under my makeup. It really does give me a glowy look without putting any other primers on. I still have a glow to the skin. It also is very hydrating. So I apply it actually in the morning and in the evening. You don't need both of these, but I love them for different reasons. If I'm looking for more of that glow, then I go with the Numbuzzin. If I feel like my skin is dry during the day, this works great as a moisturizer. More recently, I purchased this from CauseRx, super affordable. It's a moisturizer. It's their Advanced Nail 92 All-in-One Cream. I think this is wonderful. Now it has that tackiness to it, as you can see, but it doesn't feel tacky on my skin. I love the way it sinks in quickly. Again, this is another product that plays well under makeup, and that is really important to me. I don't have a lot of time in the morning between when I put my skincare on and when I have to get ready for work. So I'm on this tight deadline and I can't put any heavy creams on. They just wouldn't sink in enough before I go in with my foundation. This gives more deep moisturization. So if your skin's pretty dry, this is going to help you out. I like applying both an essence and a moisturizer. That seems to keep my skin in a good place. This also soothes the skin. I find if my skin is having a time due to allergies, when I'm just more sensitive to everything, that this works beautifully. I know I can count on it. I'm not going to get some kind of rash. Sometimes if I apply too heavy of a moisturizer, it just is not good for my skin, sort of weighs it down, makes my skin look heavier. This doesn't because it's so lightweight. Those are my top six Korean skincare. Let me know if you've tried anything that you're loving. These all work so well. They're very affordable. This is on the higher price, the stick, but I feel like it will last me a long time. It has so far, and I really like how portable it is, and I love the ingredients also. Let me know your Korean skincare favorites. Everything's linked in the description of the video that I showed today. I appreciate you all so much. I love you, and I hope you have a blessed week. I'll see you soon.